Today's recipe is going to be based on a viewer's picked ingredient and this ingredient was requested by Rocky for squash so I'm going to share a squash recipe. I have all the ingredients I'm going to add to my squash today and squash doesn't need a lot. I like to add fresh ingredients. I have some garlic, mariwari pepper, green onions, fine thyme, regular onion. I have a tomato. I'm going to chop these up and be right back. I also have some freshly squeezed coconut milk in some water. So we're going to make this a squash in coconut milk and some smoked bangamiri. I have everything ready now for our coconut milk squash with smoked fish, my tomatoes, garlic, salt, pepper and thyme, green onions, regular onion, smoked bangamiri soaking in some water so we can soften it up a little. And my coconut milk and squash, let's head on to the stove and put these amazing ingredients together. So in the pan, I have about a tablespoon and a half of oil. We're gonna go in with our onions and we'll cook the onions about a minute and a half or so. So now that our onions been cooking up, we're gonna add our garlic in here. Mix that in and we're building flavors. So now we're gonna add our squash. And I just remove it from the water. We're gonna mix this together and this is frozen squash this was squash from my garden last summer and this is the last of it so I'm prepping myself for 2022 new garden squash this year I'm gonna add my salt And all the measurements will be listed in the description box below. Black pepper. We're gonna mix our salt and black pepper in. We're gonna add our thyme and pepper. Give, it a, give this a mix. Let's go in with our tomatoes. We're gonna let this cook for a few minutes and then we'll come back to add our coconut milk. So our squash is cooking up nicely. I'm gonna go in with our coconut milk now. And I think I'm just gonna add about one cup of the coconut milk in here. And the coconut milk would add a nice sweetness to the squash and give it a very beautiful finish. Once it starts cooking up a little, I'm gonna add the fish into the pot. Our coconut milk squash is looking nice. It smells so nice and delicious. I'm gonna add the smoked fish now. And this smell brings me right back to Guyana. This lovely smell of coconut milk and squash and smoked fish. And now I'm gonna add my green onions. I'm gonna add some now and I'll keep some to garnish for later. I will cook this about two to three minutes more. 
and this will be ready. I'm gonna start preparing my roti for this meal. My beautiful squash cooked in coconut milk and smoked bangamiri is done. I'm gonna turn my stove off. And again, I wanna mention, this was one of the viewer ingredient requests for this month. And this was a request from Being Rocky. So here is the squash and coconut milk and some smoked fish. I cook it a little bit different today. I'm gonna start clapping up my roti and then I'll play it up soon. Here is our beautiful squash cooked in coconut milk and smoked fish and we have some parathas or oil roti to go with it. I'm gonna play it up and reveal the taste test. Before I do so, Sister Donna tried the Faluda recipe that I shared on my channel and she sent us some clips of her success story and she is just teasing me because I feel like having a glass of her Faluda right now. So right after this, I'm gonna share her Faluda story before I do the taste test. Jesse, are you finished with school? Somebody sent you a package. Are you expecting a package from anyone? When you finish with school, please come down and let's check out who sent you a package today. Somebody sent you two packages. You want to take your time and open them. I want to see who is sending you packages. I wonder who. Open this one. And let's see. Be careful, okay? Look, I'm so excited for her. Mm -hmm. It's a good feeling to open packages, right? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so cute. It's, what is it? Oh my god. It's like god. a little angel. Open it and let's see. You okay, see? it's so cute. Oh my god. Pull out. Oh god, look. Let's see. It's a little baby angel. Wait, wait, wait. Take it, take it, take it. Take it out, take it. It's a beautiful, nice, sunny day. <gasps> oh my god, this is so cute. What does it say? It says, you're an angel. Oh my, oh my god, god, look. Let me see. Oh. Oh. She's so cute. Oh my goodness. She has short hair just that like you. That is so cute. She has short hair just like Jessica. You can put it on your, in your room. Oh my god, yeah, look. That is so pretty. Just look at the wings. Yeah, it's so pretty. Aww, oh my god, thank you. you. So who sent it to you, Jess? I don't know. You have to, I think there is something else in here. Maybe there is something to tell where it came from, but you gotta be careful that you're not cutting anything, okay? Lucky Jess. They are so cute. Yay. Yeah, and I have short hair like yours. <laughs> yeah, okay. So cute. We got him. I don't know how to cut back in it. Oh, something else? Yeah. What is it opening? It's a set. It said this is a set on here. Do not separate. A set with the um the little angel. Oh, oh my god. This is so beautiful. I think you can put the what is it? Is let me see. Oh, it's a bracelet. Oh, open it. Oh my god, yeah, I don't know how to open it. Wow, that's Look. so pretty. Oh my god, that is so beautiful. That is so pretty. I can adjust it to fit you. You can oh go to God. church with it. It is so beautiful. It is so Let me beautiful. see. Close up. Close up. 
put it on the thing thing. Let me see. Okay. Oh my god, it's so nice. Yeah. Wow. And it's like an angel hair. Just you see the wings? Yeah, it's so beautiful. Oh my god, that's, that's actually so cute. It's beautiful, Jess. I didn't realize that Read your note angel. now and let's see who it came from. Okay. Is that the note? Mm -hmm. To Jessica, this is just a small gift to acknowledge your warm heart and kindness. I am so proud of you for donating your beautiful, long, healthy hair to a lucky child. I'm so proud of you. From Shamiza with love. Thank you so much, Auntie Shamiza. You love it? Yes, it's, it's so beautiful. beautiful. And on behalf of Jessica and myself, Sister Shamiza, we would like to say a big thank you to you. This is so beautiful. And I know Jessie likes things like these. And she's going to keep them in her room. And she get a nice bracelet to wear to church. Amazing. And you can keep your notes. So once again, thank you so much. Jess, she sent it to you because you cut your hair to donate it to a child. There's another note. Another note? Mm -hmm. Okay. Jessica, you are truly an angel sent from above to help a child in need. And to put a smile on her face. From Shamiza with love. Thank you. Oh, that's so beautiful. So thank you again, Sister Shamiza. What do you want to say, Natalie? Thank you. But it looks really cute. It is cute. It's yeah. So here is my squash cooked in coconut milk. My paratha roti. That my smoked bangamiri. I'm going to go in for a piece with the fish. I have a piece right here and some of the squash. I try not to melt all the squash today. Cheers, this mouthful goes for all you guys. Mm. So delicious. A little bit high with the pepper, but you need pepper for squash. Mm. The smoked fish makes everything taste better and the coconut milk. This is such a delicious meal tonight. I wish you guys can taste this, the combination of the squash, the coconut milk and the smoked fish is amazing. I have to take another mouthful. So if you like this recipe, please give me a thumbs up if you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, I hope you'll consider subscribing. Hit that notification bell so you get all my videos as soon as I upload one. I would like to say thank you all for your love and support towards my channel. Stay blessed, stay safe. Bye for now.